Hello everyone! In this ClickFunnels 2.0 tutorial, I will show you how to easily enroll users into the course that you created in ClickFunnels 2.0. We will cover the cases when you are selling your course or giving the free access and what to do if you refunded the payment for the course or if a customer issued a charge back. One thing before we get to it, if you don't have your ClickFunnels 2.0 account yet, then you can find a link to a free trial in the description of this video. And if you're already using ClickFunnels 2.0, in the description of this video, you will find links to the packages that will save you on your ClickFunnels 2.0 subscription. Now let's dive into it. The first way how you can enroll users into your course is by creating a product and linking it with your course. That's mostly applicable for the paid courses. From the course dashboard, you can go to the Linked Products tab and click link product if you already have a product created for your course or create a new product. Or if you want to start from scratch, you just need to go to the product tab that you can see here, then create new product. If you don't know how to do that, you can watch a tutorial by clicking on the card up here. We will use the product that I already have here. Click on this product, to open the settings, scroll a bit to the purchase action section. We're going to use the course access action Click this plus icon, select the course to which you want to give access. You can also expand this section to see which modules you want to give access to and click save. This way, this product is now linked with our course. Next, you could go to your funnel where you're selling the course and add this product to the funnel step where you have the checkout element. This is also covered in the tutorial about creating products. By the way, if a customer issues a chargeback, or you issue a refund, the access to the course will be automatically revoked by ClickFunnels. If we now go back to our course and refresh the page, we see that the course was converted from the free course to a paid course, and we also have one product link to this course that you can find in the linked products tab. The second way how you can enroll users into your course built in ClickFunnels 2.0 would be by manually giving them access. To do that, go to the contact step, find the contact that you want to give access to and click on the name of the contact to open the settings. Select the enrollment step, click manage enrollments, add enrollment and select the course that you want to give access to. Click save. With that, this contact will get an automated email from ClickFunnels with the link to access the course. And the third way how you can enroll contacts into your course in ClickFunnels 2.0 would be by using a workflow. This way would work if you have a free course and you would want to give access to the course automatically. Let's say we have a free course as a bonus and if a user opts in on our funnel page built in ClickFunnels 2.0, we want to give them access to the course automatically. We can set this up in the workflow. So I have created a workflow already, then you need to set a trigger, click add a trigger, in the event type select opt-in, select the funnel and the page where the users opt-in, I don't want to have anonymous contacts and make sure that the trigger is active. Click Create Trigger. Next, click this plus icon and select the Enroll action. Select the course to which you want to give access and click Create step. After that, in the same workflow, you can also add a few emails or if you want to manage contacts in some way, you can also do it with the actions in the workflow. Don't forget to enable this workflow. And after that, when somebody opts in on this funnel page that we selected in the trigger, they will be automatically given access to the course and ClickFunnels also will send them an automatic email with link to access the course. Those are three ways how you can enroll users into your course in ClickFunnels 2.0, depending on whether you're selling your course or giving them access for free. If this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and enable notifications to not miss out on the future content. And I will see you in the future videos.